Hey there, it's Michael from Traveling Tips. In this video, I'm taking you to the relaxing valleys north of Los Angeles in Ventura County and the city of Ojai, California. Only 90 minutes drive from central Los Angeles puts you in a whole other world and frame of mind. For years, Hollywood elite and those in the know have come to this tiny town tucked away between the mountains to find peace and rest. Join me as we check out some of the things to do in Ojai in one day. I'm in Ojai, California. Ojai, California is located in the hills of Ventura County, about 15 miles inland from the Pacific Ocean. The town and surrounding area have a population of about 7,500 full-time residents. The town was put on the map by the Ojai Valley Inn Resort, known for its variety of spa treatments. But we're here to explore a bit of the outdoors, the food scene, and some special shops that you can see in one day. We're getting the day started at Ojai Coffee Roasters, right in the heart of downtown on Ojai Avenue. It's a cute space for a coffee and to take a break from the heat. Even early in the day in the summer, it is hot here in the valley. Make sure to drink lots of water and wear sunscreen. Down the street is one of the biggest tourist draws to Ojai. Bart's Books is the world's largest outdoor bookstore and has been in operation since 1964. Bart's sells many secondhand books and offers a trade and sell program. You never know what you'll find available for sale at Bart's. You've probably seen this spot on Instagram. Make sure to tag their Instagram page when you post to share this great treasure of the Ojai Valley. For lunch, I'm heading to Marche Gourmet Deli, a 35-year staple of Ojai Avenue. This local European-themed shop serves great lunch sandwiches, coffee, and sides. The friendly staff helped us navigate the menu because it all just looks so good. I had a great sandwich made fresh to order which hit the spot for a reasonable price. Some other good eats in the downtown area include the Yumi Japanese Burger Cafe, where I had some takoyaki. And the Nest Restaurant, where I had a small pizza. The town has other shops and a museum along the main street. I stopped into a local indoor plant store called Plant Base and a locally owned store called Fig Curated Living. One of the popular pastimes of this region is wine tasting. We're doing a tasting at Majestic Oak Vineyard's Winery Tasting Room, which is a sunken garden with lots of tree cover to beat the heat. A refreshing white wine hits the spot on this day. A scoop of gelato from Sanders & Sons does the trick too. Ojai has a weekly night farmer's market at the elementary school near downtown. It's really great to experience the local things to do. Much of the parking is free with a two or three hour time limit. I ended up having to move the car a couple times throughout the day, so make sure to read the signs. Whether you want to come to Ojai to relax or just escape LA, 
you'll feel transported while in this valley. It's an easy day trip up the coast and makes a great weekend getaway for couples or just friends. If you liked this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss my upcoming trips. Also, follow me on Instagram at Traveling Tips so you can experience my trips live. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.